You know, it's yeah. not only is it a beautiful fall time, but it's also time for the North Coast Fest. Yes, and that's also a beautiful time, right? Yep, yep. You Depending still on what Joe has got going on. Yeah, wow. you still have today and tomorrow yeah. to check it out. And of course, we've got Joe Skrzeszewski is there right now to tell us about one of this year's performers. Joe? Yeah, that's right, Monica. North Coast Fest is a great opportunity to get some great food, maybe get some Scandinavian gifts for your loved ones, and also hear some really good music. Uh, one of the free stage performers at this year's festival is no stranger to the Huss Fest. Molly B. and Ted Lang are back this year. Molly has made a name for herself all across the country as a polka performer. Molly and Ted also co-host a two-hour polka party radio show on Sundays. Annual festival goers will likely recognize Molly B. This is her ninth time performing at the Huss Fest. Earlier today, I got the chance to talk with Molly, and she says getting to meet with her fans is a highlight of each stop in the Magic City. I just absolutely love that part. I love the fact I could be on stage and pouring my heart out and people feeling it in their heart, but then also meeting the people afterwards and they come to say hello or take a picture or whatever that may be. Yeah, she's good. Now, if you haven't had the chance to see Molly and Ted perform, no worry. They're performing right now actually across from me in Reykjavik Hall, but they have two more shows tomorrow, Saturday at 9.30 a.m. and 3.15 p.m. in Reykjavik Hall right here in the State Fair Center. Their show is free to attend with your general admission ticket. Now, Monica and Kevin, something else interesting about Molly, she's actually appeared in a major movie before. She appeared alongside Clint Eastwood in the 2018 film The Mule and got to perform polka music alongside Clint Eastwood. So she's able to uh, perform on the silver screen as well. A lot of fun. Well, that's a treat right there, right? And be, be by uh, Clint Eastwood. But Joe, uh, I got a question for you. You get around. I mean, you really do. You, you're at the Norse Who's Fest in a couple of days ago, hanging out with Governor Burgum and uh, just great reporting. Just want to let you know that here on the air. And uh, your, your first thoughts on California and, uh, and the weather of the West Coast. I know it was great out there. Well, thank you so much. I, I didn't think that this week I'd be uh, seeing the Pacific Ocean, but we were able, myself and Michael Anthony, were able to go out to Simi Valley and cover it. And in a matter of 48 hours, I go from politics to polka. I guess yeah. that's how it works. But nonetheless, it's great to be back in North Dakota. It's been one heck of a week. Well, I'm disappointed in one thing. I understand my source is telling me that you guys did not partake of In-N-Out Burger, but next time, next time you're in California, you got to try it. They're, they're in Colorado now, too, in Texas. So you got you scouts got on her. Scouts on her. Next <laughs> right. time we will. Thanks a lot, Joe. Thanks, Have a Joe. good time yeah. there. <laughs> All right.